There are now two confirmed human cases of the West Nile virus in Allen County and another four possible cases are under investigation. In an exclusive interview last week with a woman who got West Nile, News Channel 15 showed you how serious the virus is. Tonight, well-being reporter Alyssa Ivinson continues our coverage with what you need to know to stay safe. Well, statewide, there are 16 human cases of West Nile this year and two people have died from the virus. While most people won't have severe symptoms, West Nile can be very serious. Health officials say prevention is key. Most people who get West Nile from a mosquito bite don't have symptoms. 20% will have some symptoms like fever and muscle and headaches, but for 1% it's serious. Neurologic changes, they get confused, um, they may have numbness, tingling, weakness in an arm or leg or both, um, severe headache, anything like that. Uh, you just need to be seen right away. West Nile cases are up this year. Last year, Allen County had one. This year, two confirmed and four possible cases. That's partly because of the weather and... People, you know, getting a little bit apathetic maybe about using repellent. It was crushing and it was relentless. It was the most horrible pain I've ever been through in my life. Last week, News Channel 15 told you Darla Keller's story. She was in the hospital for 15 days with West Nile virus. Even if it's only less than 1%, but you're in that less than 1% and you have severe consequences, it's 100% for you. That's why Allen County Health Commissioner Dr. Deb McMahon says it's so important for people to remember <laughs> the repellent. When we know there's the potential for something serious that can have permanent long-term problems, prevent it. Repellent with DEET is recommended, but there are some other natural chemicals in some products that will work just as well. You just have to apply those a little more often. And don't stop spraying until November. Even though it starts to cool off, the fall is actually prime time for West Nile cases. All right, good to know. Thank you very much.